All right, guys, if you want to be towing a trailer with your vehicle, we will have to install wiring for it. That'll get all the trailer lights working. Uh, it is required by state law, so let's get into it. You will need the tool seen here to complete this installation. All right, guys, uh, here we have our harness for our pickup. Uh, it's actually really simple to do this. It's just a simple T-connect, and our plug that we're going to be using from the factory is right here. So we'll just go ahead and separate these two and we'll put this into place. Just like that, they come apart. We can go ahead and grab our harness. Make sure your tabs line up. Everything's nice and smooth. You can see that we've got it all plugged in. The next step from here is we're gonna have to go ahead and ground out this wire and we'll do that in a moment. All right, we got our ground wire here and we got a self-tapping screw. We're just gonna take that right here to this little cross member uh, and that'll ground out our electrical harness. All right, we use the self-tapping screw. We got our electrical nice and tight. Now from here, we're gonna go ahead and mount our four flat and clean it up and make it look real nice. All right, guys, we got all our wiring hooked up. Uh, now it's just time to mount our four flat. Some people are just going to attach it to the tow loop or they're going to drape it over the hitch. Some people like to just leave it dangling. Uh, don't let it leave dangling. It's going to cause damage to the wires. Uh, so what we're going to do is for a few extra dollars, we're going to take this very handy bracket. We're going to attach it to our pickup right here, and that's going to hold our four flat, and it's going to look very nice and clean when we're done. So let's get to it. What we're going to be using to install this bracket are just two small self-tapper screws. And once again, it's just very easy to just to go ahead and set this up there. Good. We'll make sure it's nice and straight. We'll go ahead and set our other screw in place. All right, now that we have our bracket up, we're gonna go ahead and mount our wiring. The first thing I'm gonna to wanna to do is come over top of the hitch. That's gonna keep it preventing from hanging underneath any damage that could happen. We're gonna go ahead and stick this through. There are two notches, if you can see here, on your four flat head. Those are gonna rest right in that slot right there. Four flat is mounted. You can put your little cover on it. Now the next step, we're gonna go ahead and clean all this up so you won't even see it. All right, guys, we went ahead and mounted our four flat head. The next step here is going to be to go ahead and clean all of this up. So I'm just going to grab a few zip ties and we're going to go ahead and bundle up our wire and then we're going to go ahead and mount it up high underneath. So we just get a good, good bunch of it here and we're going to go ahead and put a zip tie around it to keep it all together. Just like so. We can go ahead and cut the end of that off there. And then we're going to take one more zip tie and we're just going to take it up here and secure it. That way it's out of the way. Alrighty, we got that zip tie. We'll go ahead and cut that off. Alrighty, we are all set. Let's see. All right, that should be it, guys. We are all set. Wiring's on and mounted. Um, I want to take the time to thank you for enjoying watching this video with us on how to install the wiring on your Chevy Silverado. Have a good day. To learn more about the product seen in this video, or to schedule an installation by a U-Haul Hitch Professional, visit us online today at uhaulhitches.com.